Carroll. During the NFL season, Pete Carroll spends his Sundays strutting up and down the sidelines. The Seattle Seahawks, energetic head coach and a gum-chewing football mastermind. My gum's game day. <laughs> if I chewed gum like that all the time, I don't know what I would be. I... But today, Coach Carroll returned to the place where his career all began. The place is really flying, and I'm, I'm proud to be part of it. High-fiving his way up to the stage at the University of the Pacific's commencement ceremony. And so it's really fun to come back, and, and uh, I, but I'm most impressed with how beautiful the campus is now, even more so than ever. Carroll earned his bachelor's degree from UOP in 1973 and later received his master's in 1978 while playing football as a free safety for the Tigers. There was a toughness about that group and there was a, a competitiveness about us and a kind of a, a brotherhood about it that, um, you know, it just doesn't go away. It is now my pleasure to invite Mr. Pete Carroll to the podium. And now, almost 45 years later, he's recognized with one of the highest honors the university can bestow. I am delighted to confer upon Pete Carroll the honorary degree of Doctor of Business Administration. Dr. Carroll, congratulations. This was a very, very meaningful time. So to come back, the recognition, you know, I'm humbled by that. I don't know how they're calling me a doctor. Whether it's winning two national championships with USC or a Super Bowl title with the Seahawks, Pete's passion and pride started at Pacific. Uh, the, the culture that we have created around our teams over the years and, and, uh, and the philosophy and the approach and the uncompromising principles that were built on were all founded here. So Dr. Carroll will celebrate today, but quickly change back to Coach Carroll. Training camp is fast approaching, and the Seahawks rookies will report next week. Our guys will they'll welcome them in. They know that you know, they're their teammates and all, but there's still a transition. It's not a whole lot different than watching the graduates take a step off, you know, they step off a of campus and, okay, here I go the rest of my life. Well, that's kind of what we, we experienced in, in this, this week coming up. Thank you so much for letting me be a part of this. In Stockton, Michelle Dapper, KCRA 3 News.